So I recently had a question come in from my wife of all people about how to kind of keep things concise or how to keep things on point whenever you're creating content. Maybe it's a video, maybe it's an email newsletter, maybe it's a blog post, but how to stay on point. Well, the first thing that we have to think about is why we're doing this. In most cases, you're doing it to get and maintain the attention of the, the reader, the listener, the viewer, and move them towards a desired outcome for, for you two to work together in some way, then buy, to buy your product, to join your program. So we have to know that even if we're talking about 10 different topics, they're not going to stay attentive for 10 different topics. So if we're actually focused on that desired outcome, how do we keep things moving that direction? We have to simplify and we have to kind of be of this mindset that hey, you know what, I can come back tomorrow with topic number two and come back the day after with topic number three. And now I've got this chain of an interaction that ultimately the more interactions that we have that are good, where they feel like they got a benefit they can take away from, the more likely they're gonna come on board and actually become a paying client, a paying customer. So understanding why we're doing this in the first place. The biggest mistake when it comes to creating content is, hey, I just have to get something out. I just have to create content. You're not thinking about how it plays into this bigger objective, this bigger goal of moving somebody from interested to ready to do business with you. So keeping that at the forefront, what you're trying to accomplish is step number one. Number two, get clear about what you want that person to take away from the thing that you're creating, from the email that you're writing, the video you're creating, get clear about that thing and say, okay, this is the only thing I'm trying to accomplish, so how do I help them accomplish it? And then number three, put a deadline, have a timer. Anytime that you're on stage at a public speaking event, it's pretty simple. They give you a clock and they say, okay, it's 60 minutes, at 50 minutes, at an hour and 15 minutes, you're done, get off the stage. Well, that's kind of the same thing here. Give yourself a timer and say, okay, I have to convey this point and help somebody understand it because it's not about what you say, it's what they get, what they understand and benefit from. So how can I get this across in the time that I've allotted myself to do it? And if I know where I'm trying to take somebody from here to there, and I know what I'm trying to convey in this one video, and I know what my deadline is, should be in pretty good shape. So hopefully that helps you really stay concise and get more bang for the buck for each video or each article or really any piece of content you create.